goodness, I'm so excited because this is the, like, starting kind of the Halloween semi-tutorials, if you know what I mean. So today's actual, not today, but, like, this week's actual challenge is going to be makeup art. And my inspiration for this challenge is kind of weird. It's actually a peacock. Sorry. Yeah, so don't ask me why or how I came up with a peacock. I, it was just weird. Like, me and my friends were, like, doing something, and someone said, oh, that reminds me of a peacock. And I'm like... And here I am, getting ready to show you guys how to make yourself look like a peacock. Sounds logical. But anyways, I'm super, super excited for this week because, yeah, it's Halloween stuff. So, super, super exciting. Thank you guys so much for letting me get this far and voting for me. I love you guys so much. I guess I'm still in shock that I made this far. This is absolutely insane. So thank you guys so much. And when she said, like, use makeup art or whatever for the challenge, I immediately thought of one of our judges, Leisha, because she's the reason, well, I found her channel from like her crazy makeup tutorials and stuff like that so immediately I thought of like her bright colors and kind of used her as a little bit of inspiration and stuff so thanks Leisha and yeah. Hmm. Anyways it's enough rambling about me let's go ahead and get on to this tutorial. Hope you guys enjoy it. Comment below and let me know what you think. Subscribe to my main channel which is SoFetch08 capital S three O's Fetch08 of course and subscribe to Hella Style to keep up with all the beauty smarties. And don't forget to like this video so you can vote for me. And I can stay in the competition and I can keep making videos for you guys, of course. Duh. So, again, I hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial. And let's go ahead and get on to it. Thanks, bye. Peace. Wow, hello my lovelies. To begin this makeup look, we're going to start with the Too Faced Shadow Insurance and apply all over our eyelids to ensure our shadows last all day and all the colors stay on vibrant. Next, I'm going to be taking my dense crease brush and apply my LA Colors Purple Shadow into the crease and a little bit onto the outer corners. And now with a flat shader brush, I'm going to take I'm going to rub a little bit of that same purple shadow onto our lower lash line. And now I'm going to take in a Urban Decay eyeliner in Radium, and I'm going to line my waterline with it. Next, I'm taking my Sally Girl Turquoise Baked Eyeshadow with a flat shader brush and pat it onto the center of our eyelids. And now I'm taking an Anastasia Matte White Highlight Pencil and highlight the inner corners to prep them for color. Now I'm going to be taking my MAC palette in the color Jux on a flat shader brush and I'm going to be patting it into the inner part of our eyes. And you're just going to keep blending and keep blending. Next I'm going to be taking the Balm 6 Pot in No Money No Honey which is a loose mineral shadow. I'm going to be patting it into the inner corners of my eyes and also all over my lids to give it a little bit of sh like, you know what I mean? A little bit of shimmer. It looks a little bit matte and peacocks are shimmery. Next, I'm taking my Clinique eyeliner. I'm going to use it to line my tight line. Make it look a little bit more dramatic. And now, with my L'Oreal Infallible Gel Liner and my Clinique Liner Brush, I'm going to line my upper lash line like normal. Not too thick, not too thin, just normal. And of course, the fun part, false lashes! Yay! <laughs> and ne next I'm using my liquid liner and I'm going to be dotting it, this is kind of weird, but I'm going to dot it on my crease and trace it back down onto the lash line. And now I'm going to be tracing the outline of the peacock feathers with a white eyeliner on my cheek. Go ahead and line over with the Maybelline gel liner and brown and eggplant to give it a little bit more of a contrast. Next, I'm going to be tracing over it again with a black liquid liner and make flick lines to create the feathers. Ok, 
keep doing as many flicks as you want until you get the desired amount. Whether you want full feathers or thinner feathers. But one cute little way that gives your look a little bit more pizzazz, I took half baked for my Urban Decay Naked palette and I used it just how I was doing the eggplant and the brown and gel liners and putting it into alternating into the feathers, giving it a little bit of a sheen. And here comes a little bit of a tricky part. I'm going to be taking my flirt and body jewels and stick them wherever I want, but mainly underneath my left eye and a little bit on the feather. And now to finish off the look, I'm going to be taking my Revlon lipstick in Wild Orchid and just apply all over my lips like a normal lipstick, of course. And I'm going to be taking my NYX lip gloss in African Queen, which I didn't show, but I did put that on in the pictures and stuff like that. So I hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial. Don't forget to vote for me, subscribe to my main channel, and I'll talk to you guys later. Bye!